It's going to be a pretty quiet week. Now today, the big story actually today through tomorrow morning, the western foothills, it's going to be windy. No big surprise there. That seems to be the norm nowadays, but we just had a gust of around 40 in Livingston earlier this morning. <clears throat> As we go along today, we anticipate that's going to be stronger. So around the Livingston Nye area, we could have gusts 40 to 50 miles an hour through tomorrow morning. Uh, big timber to Harlington, that corridor there, we can have gusts up to 60 miles an hour. Rest of us going to be somewhat breezy over the next couple of days. So just keep that in mind, though, especially along the western foothills. If you drive a high profile vehicle, big truck, big rig, or if you're toting a trailer that they could fishtail on you. High pressure is going to be the dominant factor this week. It's going to keep us dry. Maybe by the end of the week, though, we could see some Pacific moisture coming in that could give us some mountain snow Friday through the early part of next week. Not looking like we're going to see much of anything here in the lower elevations. Now we're going to be warmer than average the next couple of days because of the sunshine. So we get into Thursday, Friday, we're going to cool down as those clouds will increase. We're going to see highs in the 30s and 40s, and then we're going to try to rebound as we get back into the weekend, back to seasonal. And that's what we're looking at today. Uh, seasonal temperatures are around seasonal with highs in the 30s and 40s. We'll see some clouds mixing in with a sunshine. Pretty quiet day outside of those winds that I mentioned. There's that sunshine for Tuesday, Wednesday, warming us up. Cold front brings the cool down Thursday, Friday, and then Saturday, Sunday, trying to get back to around seasonal. You notice a lot of cloud cover this weekend, but I still think here in Billings, we're not going to get much of that Pacific moisture, so basically just staying dry.